Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. So for those of you new to the channel, this channel is all about a challenge I've undertaken, which is what if we did every single thing, every single day that we know would be good for us to do? That's it, compile the whole list of everything that would be good and do it every single day. Is that possible? Um, and if it is possible, how? If it's overwhelming, how overwhelming is it and what can we do? Okay, now, tripped over a few of those words, but those that are my regular viewers know that I do this all in one take, upload it, and then we are done. And we do that to save a lot of time because I need to, because I've got so many other things on my list. Okay, here we go, tip one that I've learned. So I've got over 40 things on my list that I'm trying to do every single day. What helps me get it done is clustering. So similar things bring them together. So at the moment, I'm carrying an injury in my hamstring. So I've got some physio work, I do some core work every day, and I do yoga. So boom, those three things all cluster together and I make them part of my morning routine. So it's a routine or regimen that I do every single morning and I go through the core work, the yoga and the physio work. So that's my tip for you. Start, if you're doing the same, if you're thinking of trialing it, if you have a checklist of those things that you want to do every single day, cluster them together. What are similar things that you should do? And what, what, what are similar things you should do together? And determine what time of the day you should do them. Do they help you wake up in the morning and get ready for the day? Or are there things that you should be doing in the evening that help prep you for the next day? So get into clustering. If you're doing that, get into clustering. It is working for me. Okay, another update soon. And I think, to be honest, we've got to make a call soon on what do we do with this list of 40 plus things to do each day. Do I do it for the rest of my life or do I just do it for the next week? So what is the longevity of this and, and how would it look to support longevity? So I've got to make a call soon, I think, on, on where we go from here. So anyway, that will be coming up soon. If you want to be kept in the loop, you know the deal. Just hit on subscribe. Hit on subscribe? No. <laughs> hit subscribe. And, um, and you'll be kept in the loop. Uh, if you like this video, anyway, click like. I mean, it's not that great. Um, tomorrow's one will be better. Hang around for that. Um, I'm going to define what a workout should be. It's not just the working out part. It's the whole bunch of stuff you do before and after. Much, I suppose, in the same theme as this clustering. Anyway, I'm out of here. I've taken up too much of your time. The whole premise of these videos is sharing what I've learned, and if you can steal things to make life easier for you, do that. So if you've got a whole bunch of stuff you want to do every day, look at those things and start to cluster them. So they naturally lead from one to the other, and you can do them in clusters and get many things done that way. Take care. Hope you've had a great Christmas. Catch you on the other side.